Don't stop when you're tired. Stop when you're done. We are relentless. We are powerful. We are forward thinkers. We are the generation of hard workers, innovators, and creators. And we are the ones who never give up, never surrender, and never quit on our goals. We understand that it is only time that separates us from our success because we know as long as we're willing to put the work in, we will get there in the end as long as we never quit. Don't stop when you're tired. Stop when you are done. Once a quitter, always a quitter. Prove them wrong. You are relentless. You will never stop. This isn't a game to you. This is life or death. For people like us, our goals and dreams are worth more than anything worth more than money, worth more than the partying and chilling with our friends. It is worth more than social media status, worth more than the clothes that you wear and the car that you drive. We can see beyond that. We know that nothing in the world matters unless we are moving toward our dreams and achieving our goals. Once we move in that direction, everything else will fall into place. If you have an idea, move on that idea. If you have a goal, move on that goal. If you are inspired or motivated, move on that inspiration. Don't stand and watch the world go by. Get out there and take in as much of the world as you can. You are not going to give up because of a little pain. You won't quit because of a bad situation. It isn't in your nature to give up on this. You don't stop when you're tired. You stop when you're done. You stop when you get the job done. You finish when you have done enough work to make progress. A little pain along the way is your rite of passage. It is the battle scars of the successful, the marks of a warrior who succeed at this adventure through life. What will your scars say about you? How many battles will you pull through to come out the other side a winner? Come out the other side an ultimate version of yourself. If you are a bodybuilder, no matter the exercise of choice, it takes repetition to grow. You have to tear the muscle in order to grow. Repetition is key. Why would it be any different for the mind and success? Repetition equals growth. We are what we repeatedly do every day. You don't become something overnight. bad or good. You don't become an alcoholic by having one drink. You don't become a billionaire by making one sale. You don't become a football player by having one training session. You don't become a bad person by making one mistake. You don't become something by doing it once. Good or bad? Once you build habits towards your goal, it becomes calcified in your mind. Your will and desire to win are greater than anybody else's. I know you are aware of how bad you want this. I know you are aware of what you would give to succeed. When you see someone that is successful, a football player scoring the winning goal or a singer performing at the Super Bowl, they have put themselves in that position because of the habits that they have repeated day in and day out for years. If you want to be in that position, you must build those habits. 
I know you want this. I know it is all you want. I know what you would give for this. So do it. Show it. Prove it. Show the world. Show them that anything you can dream of can become your reality. Success is not given. It's earned. Repetition increases the chances of your success. The more times you show up, the more likely you will be heard. You need to show up. That's all there is to it. Show up and repeat. Failure is a step to success. Falling down is a step to success. Losing is a step to success. Pain is a step to success. But quitting is not. Success is getting back up and learning from these falls, learning from the pain and the losses. Success lies in getting back to your feet and trying again. Before every big victory was many small losses that we learned from, that we used as motivation to succeed. I am not here to avoid losing. I am here to make as many mistakes as I can. So when it comes time to win, I have already learned what not to do. Success comes from knowledge and determination. Are you willing to fall down? Are you willing to take the pain? Are you willing to get hurt? Are you able to get back up when everything is against you and say, is that all you've got? Imagine for a moment, you have nowhere to live, no money, just the shirt on your back. What would you do? Would you still have the will and mental fortitude to work on your dreams? Would you have the strength to keep going on your journey? Or would you crumble? Would you end up in the gutter? You see, in life, bad things happen. Sometimes life hits you on the blind side. You don't see it coming, but you need the mindset to be able to continue, the mindset to keep going when everything is falling to pieces around you. Why? Why do I need to keep going when bad things happen? Because that is life. If we all stopped when something bad happened, there would be zero successful people to ever exist. Bad things do happen. Life will hit you on the blind side, and it is in these moments that you develop true strength. It is in these moments you learn how to become successful. If you are going through a hard time right now, maybe you lost someone special to you, maybe you failed on the big stage, maybe you're struggling to get going again, know this, you are more than enough. You can do this. You will be successful. The storm will pass. This is not the end for you. And when you look back in years to come, it will be in this moment where you mark the start of your success story. When all the odds are stacked up against you, can you walk into the eye of the storm and fight again? It is in these moments that true champions are made. It is in these moments that greatness is sparked. You need to test yourself. You need to push your limits to places they have not been before. You can't do that from your comfort zone. To get stronger, you must put yourself under more pressure. Success is simply many failures that add up to a win. We forget that greats have fallen before. We forget that their journey started from the bottom. It was one step backward, two steps forward, all the way to the top. Learn to love losing. Don't be frozen by the fear of it. 
to really be something special, you must be willing to put it all on the line. You must be willing to fight without the fear of losing. No limits. You can only truly shine when you learn that losing is part of success. Fortune favors the brave, to the ones who are willing to risk it all, to the ones who are willing to put it all on the line, the ones willing to go against the grain, the ones who stand out from the crowd, the game changers, the different thinkers and industry changers. Fortune favors the brave, the different and willing. Normal and average does not change the world. It takes something special and someone different. That is why fortune favors the brave. Don't wait for things to happen. Make things happen. Boldly go in the direction of your dreams. Move forward with consistency and confidence and you will reach your goals. Repeat this in your head. I can. I will. I must. The biggest battle you will fight is with yourself. This battle will never go away. It's a fight you will have to battle for the rest of your life. You are the only person that can get yourself back up, but you're also the only person that can lie down and allow yourself to be defeated. It's a choice. You can choose to be great or not. It's down to you. I can. I will. I must. Ambition is a powerful tool. It is the thing missing to make your dreams become reality. Ambition transforms your passions from dreams to the real world. Ambition is something that is deep inside. It's something that you need in order to wake up in the morning and be excited. Loving what you do isn't enough. You must have ambition. You must not be satisfied. How can you settle when there is more to do? Never be satisfied. You should live your life as if you are a hero in your own story. You get to decide what story you make. Your book is unfinished. There are more pages to be written, new paths to go down, new places to visit, more stories to create. Go out there and don't stop until your book is finished. Life is a battle. Losing in life doesn't always mean death, but it will result in misery. Not striving for your wishes will leave you feeling empty. When the battle of life is happening, you have the choice to be victim to its relentless onslaught, or you can fight back. Fight back and start winning. Victim or victor, it is your choice. Those at the top of the mountain didn't fall there. Good things happen to those who hustle. Success is the reward of hard work and hustle. I hustle like every day is my last. I hustle because it is the only thing I know. I hustle because hard work will lead me to success. I hustle because I want this more than anything. One day, all these early mornings and late nights will pay off. One day, everything you've been working toward will be worth it. Success does not come to those who wait. Success comes to those who go out and get it. Go out there and get it. 
There is so much at stake when you are trying to live your dreams. This is why we hide from the fight. We will do anything to avoid losing because we would rather not know if we won or lost. Losing is such a fatal blow, we avoid it at all costs, even the cost of winning. We would rather not lose, so we avoid winning. It's time for 5 a.m. starts. It's time for late night finishes. It's time to work 24 hours straight. It's time to go all in. It's time to work a side hustle after you get home from work. It's time to give it your all. You need to get comfortable with losing every so often. You need to understand you may have lost the battle, but the war is not over. If you want big success, you need to be in this for the long run. This isn't a week thing. This isn't a monthly thing. This is years and years of battling. Some of you may find yourself four years into this, questioning if you will ever succeed. But that is how long it takes sometimes. Sometimes you might be 10 years deep before you strike gold. But it will be worth it. Just hold strong. The reason you need to hustle is because it will separate you from the other 99% of people. You need to be the hardest worker at all times. You need to be beating everyone around you. People should talk of your work ethic with wonder and awe. They will be shocked by how hard you work. Be strong, be brave, be fearless. What you are asking from life is an average, so you won't get it with average work. You want something special? You better put special work in. Being brave isn't being fearless. Being brave is feeling fear, feeling scared, weak, and doing it anyway. It is looking in the face of your worst fears and taking them head on. It's not being fearless. It's being fearful and still fighting. I am strong. I am powerful. I am great. I am brave. I will get back up. I will never back down. I will keep fighting. I will push forward. You want to know how I learned the value of hard work? I worked hard. So many guys out there right now thinking that hard work doesn't pay off, those same guys haven't worked hard. Those same guys haven't put in the work for a few years. Those same guys gave up after five months of hard work. Those are the guys saying hard work does not pay off. Those are the guys that say they already tried everything. No, you didn't. You will never hear a successful person say they achieved it without hard work over years and years. Those guys who slate hard work haven't worked hard. Listen, if you want to be successful, you need to work hard. If you're not willing to do that, then you will never be successful. You need to give it at least a year. At the end of that year, I guarantee you, you'll be able to look back and see how far you've come. But until you value hard work, you will never become successful. Time and hard work. Time and hard work. That's what you need. That is the perfect recipe for success. We know this. We know what we need to do. But sometimes, what we need isn't that nice. Sometimes, medicine doesn't taste that good. And the road to success is a hard one to love. It is hard to love the hard times. It is hard to smile in the grind. It is hard to stay happy when you're 12 hours deep into your work. It is hard. It is really hard. But when you value hard work, you understand that the journey is adding value to you. You see the moment you value hard work. That is the moment you learn to love it. You love it because you love how much it is worth. You know how good it is for you. You love it because you know it will get you closer to your dream. Smile when it's hard. Work out in the rain. Be happy when most would give up. Enjoy being in discomfort. Love the hard work. We are built in our darkest moments. This is where we develop the most. This is where our character comes out.
So many success stories start from the hardest of times, and this is why you must understand the value of going through these moments and learn to love being in the eye of the storm. Every moment you are there, you get stronger. Every step you take, you build muscle. Every second, your mindset becomes focused. Every hit you take, you learn to embrace the pain. In the hottest of fires, the strongest metals are made. Under the highest pressures, diamonds are made. It is in the dirt where we find gold. Throw me to the wolves and I'll return leading the pack. You see, the hardest walk you can make is the walk you make alone. But that is the walk that makes you the strongest. Make no mistake about me, the beast inside was just sleeping. He wasn't dead. Now is my time. Now is my time to show you all you should have never doubted me. I don't want to live a life where I'm scared to live my dreams. I would rather live one day as a wolf than the rest of my life as a sheep. I am here for greatness. I will show you just how great I can be. I'm going to show you that you were wrong about me. I will show the world they should have never slept on me. I will keep going. I am willing to take a risk because I understand that this is what it takes to lead to big success. I am willing to put it all on the line because I know this is what it takes to get to the high levels of success I want. I am willing to put all my time into this because I want the life in my dreams so bad. I am brave enough to dedicate my time to this. I believe in my grit and determination. I will move through my life bravely. I am always willing to endure pain for the reward of success. I can. I will. I must. Greatness is within. The wolf mentality is inside. I will unleash it for all to see. Let go of your fears and chase your dreams. I'm coming. I'm coming for everything they said I could not have. Work hard for what you want because it won't come without a fight. Success is a lonely road. Only a few dare to take it. Be so good they can't ignore you. Imagine for a moment you lost the ability to talk. You could no longer communicate through words. What would your talent say about you? How loud would your success be? It isn't your lips that your success will be told. It is on the lips of the masses that your greatness will be spoken of. You will be so great, your name will buzz from the mouths of friends, family, and then reaching out into the world. So right now, what is your work saying for you? Are people watching in awe at how hard you work? Will you inspire them so much that you will be part of their conversation tonight? Did you impress them enough for them to speak of you at social events? Every time you're getting your work in, you need to see it as a moment to advertise yourself. And the best type of advertisement is word of mouth. Work in silence. Let your results be the noise. I am the hardest worker in the room. I work hard when nobody is watching. I push my limits not for others to see. I push my limits because that is what will make me better at what I do. I'm asking myself the question. Why is this motivation thing so important to my success? Believing in yourself is the first secret to success. No matter what happens, never stop believing in yourself. It is the strongest factor of success. Self-esteem is everything. Believe you deserve it. Believe you can do it. Believe you have the ability. Believe you are on the right path. Believe you'll get it. And most importantly, believe in yourself. Sometimes later becomes never. Do it now. 
Stop waiting for tomorrow. What happens if tomorrow never comes? We are not promised more time. If you are waiting for tomorrow, then your goal doesn't inspire you enough. If you are waiting for tomorrow, do something that makes you do it today. You don't want it bad enough. You were either lazy or you were doing the wrong thing. The struggle is real. The struggle is hard. It is painful. I know it hurts. I know you have bled for this. I know blood and sweat have fell for this. I know how much sacrifice is in this. I know you might feel like giving in. Stop making excuses, just do it. Stop lying to yourself, just do it. Stop complaining, just do it. Stop quitting, just do it. Stop procrastinating, stop putting it off, just do it. Just do it, it's that simple. Nothing can get in your way when you make the decision to follow through with something. I don't know what you're going through right now. I can't feel your pain. But I do know this, I know, if you keep going, it will be worth it. I know if you resist the pain, you will get stronger. I know the more you sacrifice, the more success you will have. I know it's hard to see it right now, but a little faith is all that's needed. Faith in yourself, faith in your ability, faith that all this will pay off because it will. Nothing can stop you being successful if you commit to the process. Nothing can stop you getting what you want if you just do it. I'm not here to tell you it will get easier, but I am here to tell you that it's worth it. 5 a.m. starts, late nights, working out in the rain, pushing further than ever before. Just grit your teeth, weather the storm because it is worth it. You will become who you want to be, as long as you're willing to pay the price. There is a time to make a decision, a time to say, I'm all in. That time is now. That time has always been now. Forget the excuses. Forget the things pulling you away. Forget YouTube, forget gaming, forget social media, forget all the noise. Put yourself in a situation where the only question is, am I going to start? Yes or no, what is it going to be? I'm calling all the hustlers, all the game changers, the new generation of forward thinkers, everyone out there with an idea and a dream. You are the ones who can change the world. You are the ones who are responsible for pushing us all forward. You have a dream, a dream bigger than anyone knows. I want you to know it is possible. You can have everything you want, all your dreams, all your desires. It is yours for the taking, but you must be willing to put in the work. You become what you do the most. If you always quit, that is who you become. If you are always waiting for tomorrow, that is who you will become. The guy who is living for tomorrow. Live in the now. The only place where you can make a difference. All the young entrepreneurs out there, you have one thing all of us desire. Time. So it is time to use your time wisely. Stop playing video games all day long. Stop watching TV all night. Stop mindlessly scrolling through Instagram. Stop with the YouTube binge sessions. Stop wasting your time on things that are not going to help you get the goals you want. Stop doing things that will not help you toward your dreams. Now is the time to stand up for what you believe in. There is no better time to start working on your dreams than right now. What are you waiting for? Get going now. Don't stop when you're tired. Stop when you're done. We are relentless. We are powerful. We are the generation of hard workers. And we are the ones who never give up, never surrender, and never quit on our goals. We understand that it is only time that separates us from our success because we know as long as we're willing to put the work in, we will get there in the end as long as we never quit. I can. I will. I must.
lost. <laughs> 